here we have a venous blood track. Here you can see some on the rock there is. over here as well. And this is quite significant. The height of the blood gives you an indication of where the animal could be hit. Oh, yes, yeah. Okay. You'll find now this blood is still okay, it's still slightly slightly damp. That means it's reasonably fresh, probably within the last five or six minutes. It hasn't coagulated yeah. completely. The yeah. serum is separating out, but it's not dry yet. Yeah. Also important is the, the direction of the splash. You can see those little elongated fingers sticking oh, yeah, out. Yeah, it's indicates that direction. the direction in which the animal is running. It would be quite easy over here to see this the, the tracks, but if it was on hard ground, it could give you an indication of the direction of travel. Yes. Can, you, can you see maybe something about the speed? Yes, also, also you will find that the distance between drops will give you an indication of the animal speed. The faster it's running, the further they're going to be, sp oh, yeah. be spread out. Uh, let's also remember too that with venous bleeding, the blood is running out, it's not pumping out. When we look at uh, an arterial blood sign just now, you will see it spurts out. Oh, yeah. Usually it's, 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 uh, it's, it's wider dispersed and there's also a greater volume of blood as well. Interesting. Another indication of the height.